A WEST 2 NEWS EXCLUSIVE FIRE DESTROYS A MOTOR HOME AS IT HEADS THROUGH CENTRAL FLORIDA ON THE WAY TO MICHIGAN. BUT THANKS TO SOME GOOD SAMARITANS, THE MOTHER AND HER TEEN DAUGHTER ARE PULLED FROM THE WRECKAGE. WEST 2'S GAIL PASCAL BROWN HAS A STORY YOU'LL ONLY SEE ON WESH. You're not going to believe what this father and son saw this morning on their way to a job in Lake County that forced them to spring into action. Get your car off of it! Ross Thompson, who happens to run a business called the RV Doctor, and his son were coming down US 27 in Lake County when they saw this motorhome on fire. I looked over and I saw there was still a car attached to it, and I wanted, was concerned. I saw one man running around the outside, so I didn't think there was anybody else there because it was so engulfed, I figured they were outside. But they weren't. He went to help them while his son caught it all on his cell phone. Another man driving an 18 wheeler also stopped and helped. I noticed when I was young, there was a foot sticking out the back window. So I stopped, we ran across right away, we ran up to the back window, and we rescued our mom and their daughter. And got them out because they, could, they were, couldn't get out. They were trapped. The whole front end was engulfed. There was no way they were going through the front door. Joe Riley, his friend, and her daughter were all heading to Michigan when his right front tire blew out. It seemed like the tire was ignited and on fire almost within milliseconds. And the flames just come up. I ran out the door with a fire extinguisher trying to put the tire out, and I got burned all over. He ran back into the coach through the front firewall and was inside, and we couldn't find him. They did find him. Riley went back for a second fire extinguisher. The tires were popping and melting from the flames, but there was another concern, a 100-pound propane tank underneath the coach. And the fire was working its way back towards it, so I was yelling at people to get away from the coach for the toxic fumes and because I was concerned about that propane tank blowing. If that tank blew, it would have been a lot worse. I'm just glad I was there. I think God put me there at the right time, the right place to help those people out. But I certainly appreciate his his help. He says the motor home is a total loss, but they're going to be okay. In Lake County, Gail Pascal Brown, West 2 News.